Hey Leo, welcome to my channel. This is going to be a love reading for the sign of Leo. So if you're a Leo sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, or if you have a stellium in Leo, this reading is going to be for you. Keep in mind, this is going to be a general reading, so it might not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't, let it fly. Don't try to force the message. Also, don't let this reading take anything from you. Okay. This person, whoever you're dealing with, whoever is in your mind, they are going through a lot of internal conflicts here. This internal conflict could be regarding giving to this connection. Pentacles, Page of Cups. This person uh, really wants to communicate with you. They want to apologize to you. Whatever happened in the past, they want to apologize for all of that. But they're holding back from communicating with you. And this is the reason why they're having a lot of internal conflicts. We are, we are going to clarify the cards. But with the Six of Pentacles, there's something, there was some unequal give and take. It is possible that this person did breadcrumb you. They gave you according to when and how they wished. But the Knight of Cups is the kind of person who will sweep you off their feet. So this could be a very, very charming person you were dealing with. Someone who knew how to sweep you off your feet by saying all the right words. But when it came to actually giving to this connection... They failed miserably. The five of wands can also signify about having arguments, disagreements. It's possible a lot of arguments and disagreements happened between the both of you in the past because there was unequal give and take because this person breadcrumbed you. So there was a lot of back and forth miscommunication happening arguments disagreements happening there also could have been involved a lot of people could have been involved in this connection and they had several things to say like a lot of people a lot of opinions but the four of pentacles and the knight of cups this person really really wants sorry the page of cups and the four of pentacles this person is really really looking to apologize to you for whatever they did to you The five of wands clarifying the five of wands except this five of wands was in reverse no matter how many times this person is trying to come out of this internal conflict or whatever conflict disagreements arguments they have they can't they cannot they are trying to walk away from whatever disagreements that happened between the both of you but this is the kind of person who is holding on to whatever you said to them whatever went wrong between the both of you this person is holding on to all of that negative patterns those negative things that happened between the both of you and that is why even if they want to come towards you and apologize to you they can't do it because they're holding on to the past this could be also a very very stubborn person you are dealing with this person is really having a lot of difficulty when it comes to letting go of whatever didn't happen in the past there could have been a lot of drama between the both of you and this person is holding on to all of that so even if, though this person feels like coming towards you and charming you again, whatever internal conflict they are having, whatever negative that happened between the both of you, this is really weighing this person down.
They can't walk away. Eight of Cups came out in reverse. So this person is trying to walk away from whatever happened in the past, but they can't. They are holding on to it. See the Page of Cups, but this time it came out in reverse. This person really wants to apologize to you, but the only reason they can't is because they can't walk away from whatever happened in the past. See, the Five of Cups is also in reverse here. They are trying to walk away from whatever happened in the past. I know I'm repeating myself here, I guess. But this person cannot walk away. Now, this conflict, this uh, disagreements and arguments can be between the both of you or can be something that happened in another relationship in their past. And this person is having difficulty walking away from whatever happened in that relationship in the past. And they're holding on to that past energy. And that is why they can't come towards you. This is a very, very confused person you are dealing with. of pentacles page of pentacles the hierophant okay bottom of the deck is the hierophant and the magician this person is seeing you someone who is very defensive right now who's very def defensive who's very stubborn they also see you as someone who's capable of manifesting whatever you want if this person tried breadcrumbing you, if they tried manipulating you, you could, you almost saw through all of that. All of the manipulation this person tried doing on you, breadcrumbing, whatever it was, whatever they were projecting from their past, it is possible that this person, whatever happened in the past, they projected that to you. But the thing is, you saw through, through all of that. The Hierophant here, they definitely see you as someone who's stubborn, but someone who's very wise. The Knight of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. You are a very slow person. They see you as someone who's very slow to commit. And that is why you observe your surrounding. You're very careful about observing your surrounding. And the moment you felt like this person was breadcrumbing you, your defenses went up against them and they felt it. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Gemini here. But yeah, they definitely see you as someone who's capable of manifesting whatever you want. You could also be manifesting uh, like a lot of new things in your life right now. And you're focused on that. You're moving to newer things and you're focused on that. And when it comes to this connection, when it comes to this relationship, you have your guard up. Six of Cups, you definitely miss this person. There was a soulmate bond between the both of you. Yeah, see the Nine of Wands, the Knight of Wands. You felt like this person was a player almost. You got this player kind of vibe from this person. And the moment you got this player kind of vibe from this person, your defenses went up. The Page of, uh, sorry, the Knight of Pentacles and the Six of Cups. You were really very honest when it came to this person you were very honest to them you really considered this person seriously you considered this connection seriously you felt a connection with this person and that is why you were very loyal to them whereas this person was being a player
King of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. You saw something with this person. You saw a connection with this person. You might also feel like you gave to this person and they didn't deserve your love. The King of Cups tried coming out in reverse. This person brought a lot of emotional imbalance to you. The King of Cups is a very matured kind of a person, a very matured energy. But you feel like you behave very immaturely with this person. You were too fast to give to this person. You trusted them too easily, you might feel like. The Ten of Pentacles also tried coming out in reverse. With the Hierophant, the Ten of Pentacles, you, you wanted commitment with this person. You saw long term with this person. But they were just breadcrumbing you. They weren't willing to give you the way you wanted a connection with them. Yeah, the Knight of Cups, the King of Cups. You feel like you romanticize this connection way too much. You definitely feel like you gave to this person too much. You expected a happy ending with this person too soon. And now that things didn't work out, you are really, really heartbroken. You feel a lot of sadness when it comes to this connection. This person did cause you a lot of sadness and pain. The sun. Eight of Cups, see the Eight of Cups is repeated here twice. Six of Wands. But the Eight of Cups came out reverse again. This person wanted to move on from this connection. This person thought that it would be easy for them to move on from what they did to you. Like this is the kind of person I very off kind of a person the energy i'm picking up is very off this is the kind of person who goes about doing whatever they feel like they end up hurting people they end up hurting a lot of people they end up doing whatever they want and they don't care if they have hurt other people and this person moves on from those very easily they move on from one connection to another. They jump from one connection to another very easily. And it's the first time this person is having difficulty moving on from this connection, moving on from you. Whatever they did to you is haunting this person. They are getting some sort of clarity about their own patterns. They're recognizing the sun, the six of wands, the eight of cups. This person is recognizing whatever patterns they have, whatever they did to you, whatever they did to other people, whatever happened in the past. This person is getting that clarity about why they behave the way they behave. You could be dealing with a Leo here, another Leo. 
Yeah, see, as I said, patterns, flare energy, the devil is here. Four of Swords, yeah, they are getting clarity. Four of Swords, devil. This person is taking a break probably from everything in the life, from even socializing much. And the more they are taking a break, the more they are realizing their own patterns, their understanding what they do to people, how they hurt people, how they hurt you. Yeah, the Ace of Wands. This is definitely the kind of person who follows their wand. But they still hold a lot of passion for you. And whatever they did to you is really making them feel very, very heavy. It's a very burdensome feeling this person is feeling about whatever they did to you. And the justice. This person is understanding their own choices, this devil energy. This is uh, definitely a player you were dealing with. Someone who was very dismissive about other people. They cared about only about themselves. With the justice here, they could be receiving some sort of karma too. The justice, the tower, the hermit, they're understanding, they're realizing a lot of things. The universe is teaching them lessons. This player is realizing their own habits. And probably the universe is making them realize that the tower, there's a lot of tower moments that is happening this in this person's life right now. And that is why they're in this five of wands energy of internal conflicts, arguments, disagreements happening in their own life. And they're realizing their own patterns. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, uh, Leo, Capricorn, Gemini, Virgo, Libra. Okay, Leo. Well, that's your reading. I hope you find the clarity you've been looking for. I'll see you guys in your next reading. Until then, take care, guys. Bye-bye.